You know that phenomenon where you can like hold a seashell up to your ear and hear the ocean? I wonder if you can hear that over video. Oh. Ah, friends and family, top of the morning, you wonderful people, people. Guess what? The air is still really bad here. Like the air quality is 223 on the air index. I don't really know what that means, but it sounds bad when you compare to Morro Bay where, where it's still smoky, but the air index is nine. In whiskey years, I just got more delicious. Dad, that's a sign that I'm getting old. It's not dad anymore, huh? It's dead. Well, hell guys, let's not do the suspense thing. Let's see if we won. Oh, we got a free ticket. Everybody loves a free ticket. I'm not a complete loser. Two of them won more tickets. There was one hiding. <laughs> Look at how smoky that is. Oh man. Ugh. It's like stepping right into the smoke of a campfire, but it's the air. Gnarly, check this out. <laughs> Just a couple other important items before we head out to Morro Bay. I cut a couple holes in the ceiling the other day and ended up having to cut a hole in the wall and a hole in the floor. <laughs> I, cut, I cut several holes uh, so that we could get ethernet cable down here so that our live streams coming up this week, this week Wednesday on Triple B TV, not on this channel, Triple B TV, our other channel. We got Vin Russo coming on live He's the author of the complete boa constrictor, basically wrote the book on boa constrictors that people in the UK call it the boa bible. Uh, he's a great guy to talk to, and he's going to be our first guest on Triple B TV Live coming up this tomorrow. That's tomorrow, Tuesday. And we took votes on what time to do it, and it was literally tied. There was hundreds of people that voted, and it was literally tied between 5 p.m. and 6 p.m. Pacific time. So we met in the middle. We're doing 5.30 p.m. Pacific time to try and accommodate as many people as possible. It should be great. Also, we do have some space left for the educational show we're going to be doing here, a roaming reptile style educational program with 10 or 12 different species geared towards kids, live stream style, uh, $25 per family person, September 5th at 11 a.m., or was it 1 p.m.? Either way, whatever that text says, <laughs> that's what time. We've got space left, so if you guys are interested, make sure to email me, and uh, I'm looking forward to doing it. It's gonna be fun. Nerd! Get your Cocoa Blocks. They're back in stock, but not for long. <laughs> I forgot to tell you guys about a tip from last video, how to watermark your photos. This is all I do. I just put this little thing on there. You don't have to add any watermarking afterwards. I, I put my snake right on this little board, take the picture, and my, my logo's right behind there. Granted, somebody still could cut out around the snake because it's not over top of the snake, and that's a lot of work for somebody who's trying to be dishonest, and they're usually trying to take the easy way out, so I don't worry about that too much. But that is the tip that I left out from last video. Simple. All right, so here's what I like to do. These two snakes, Frank, are s s s okay, Southern Merokei okay, scrub python, and Smog or Sexy Motley Orange Glow Retake here. Both just had superb sheds and I'd like to feature them on a cinematic snake segment here on the snake cart. And that's exactly what we're gonna do. And I figure while we're doing that, we can also do some sticker shout outs at the same time because they are smothering my cart. Smothering, that's not the right word. How about smattered all of the carts? Sticking, sticking to my cart. Let's do it.
I'm pretty sure that if I told you guys just how difficult it was to film that little cinematic snake segment, you wouldn't even believe me. I'm gonna go get soaped and silky and smooth in the shower, and then we're gonna go sail the seas on a celebration of the uh, 17th year that I turned 22. I hope you guys enjoyed that cinematic snake Monday. Well, I still haven't showered, but we did exit the smoky side of San Luis Obispo for this nice place we're gonna do a staycation. The air index got to hazardous level in the Tascadero. It was like 227 this morning, bumped up to like 400. And so we're like, we, got, we should probably get out of here. So fortunately we are in a position where we can come do a staycation. I've been wanting to do a staycation for a long time. I've never done a staycation. Okay, I did a staycation one time before in Oahu, but other than that, I've basically never done a staycation before. And this time it was like good for our health. And uh, Still haven't showered though. Everybody else is in the shower right now. What's going on here, shower people? Oh. <laughs> yeah, Daddy can't film that. We got this beautiful view. You can see the ocean over there. I mean, we're doing all right. I just wanted to thank you guys too for all the birthday messages that I've been getting. It's just like, it's overwhelming actually the amount of love that poured in for birthday messages, but. I apologize if I didn't reply to your message directly. I, there was uh, so many people. It's like I, between phone calls and video calls of family and, and replying to messages, I wouldn't have much of the day left to do anything else if all I did was reply to messages, which is a great problem to have. I, I really appreciate all that, man. It's, it's Like I said, it's overwhelming. But we're here now and we are uh, gonna get out. of your 30s. Feels wonderful. Feels amazing. I feel like I'm the king of the world. Daddy, I'm the, you're telling me I'm a poop cycle. <laughs> yeah, okay, <laughs> boy. Mm, hey, Eli. Eli. What? Eli. What? what do you know? I know, I know. We're about to get eaten by a meagle dog. That's all I know. <laughs> Leia. What? what? Do you know? What do you love most about Daddy? Um, he's so it's really nice to hang out with him. Aww. Yeah. Eli, what? what do you love most about Daddy? <laughs> hey, what do you love most about Daddy? Well, I was gonna, you know, I was gonna wait until uh, we were like turning the engine off before we started recording like talking and stuff. All right, well, if this loud. sucks, then you can go over it. All right. This is real, man, real life. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. Real life can be loud, real life can be quiet, and we, everything in between. <laughs> you got a little first mate over there. Hey, first mate. Hi, my Hi, matey. first mate. guys can see right behind me here that's the big giant rock that we filmed I had brought my drone and I was planning to get some nice shots of us like flying around the uh, bay here with the boat but it's so foggy you can't see anything so if I took the drone out you probably wouldn't even be able to see us so, but if you missed the last video we put up some the most amazing drone footage I've ever seen that I've ever filmed in my entire life in the last video if you missed that what 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 <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you think, <laughs> you think you're funny, huh? No, I think you're funny. <laughs> anyway, it was the most amazing drum footage I've ever filmed in my entire life. So I hope you saw it. If not, you can go back and watch it. You can see exactly where we're at without the fog. Big rock right there. It's huge. Sunset boat cruise <laughs> without a sunset. <laughs> what does it feel like to be married to somebody who's almost 40? <laughs> Mommy, can I help? Um, yeah. Feels pretty dang good. I'm excited for your next decade. 
What's going on over there? I've taken the like front it. of the boat. I am the king of the world. <laughs> Because I'm at the front of the boat, boy. I hope you guys are having yourselves a great time. Thank you for joining us for today's vlog. Mm, tomorrow, our very first live stream on Triple B TV with Mr. Van Russo, just in case you forgot. Hope to see you guys there. It's gonna be a good time. And a new, new exciting chapter for Triple B TV, I think. <sighs> take care of yourselves, take care of each other. We'll see you guys tomorrow on the live stream. Bye. Happy birthday. Oops. Broke the boat. I broke the boat. <laughs> Alright, let's go home. <laughs> yeah, I don't have to see to the left of the